What's the Wi-Fi password? You can't hide from the truth. You know what else you can't hide from? My fist. In your face. Which is where it'll be soon. I don't know. Garbage! Buzzed oh. over. Hello, child. It's me, Chica. Can I be in a video someday? Oh, well, you could. But, uh... Ooh, yeah, the game series just died. No more videos. Oh. Thanks, I know you got the Wi-Fi password. Need a dick! I could do was give them the proof they asked for. Are you satisfied? Uh, uh, but you... How? But you... How? Sorry, I don't know that language. Would you be kind enough to speak in one of the seven languages I do know? <sighs> so then, we have two confirmed offenders. And one person who just happened to be there, but made no attempt to sway the outcome. By standing by and doing nothing, you've made yourself culpable. Now, what shall I do with you? Perhaps I should broadcast more than what I just played for you, and let the entire student body hear your conspiracy for itself. So you recorded us? Then you're a criminal! I fail to see how you have any rights that I should bother respecting. I'll never forgive you, understand? Your very existence is pointless! If it weren't for you, our class last year would have been exactly the way I wanted it to be. Go ahead! Broadcast our conversation! Do that and I'll crush everyone who hangs around with you the way you crushed my dreams! You're all such good buddies with your little club. There are plenty of ways to ruin that and I'd enjoy every one of them. I won't stop until your little circle of friends have left you forever! Now say, I understand, Takamiya-san. Please stop. Go on, say it! You. Huh? I 
can't hear you! Kill you. Huh? I'll kill you. It would take half as long to do the same thing to your face. You'd probably never be able to look at yourself in the mirror again. Heck, the way I'm feeling, I wouldn't mind becoming a murderer. I won't ask you to recite some silly apology. If you're frightened, hold on to that fear. And never mess with me again. Now. As far as you're concerned, we'll see nothing ever happened. Mess with me again and it's a different story. I'm sorry. <laughs> what just happened? No. No. You just wait a fucking second. What the fuck did you just call me? What the fuck did you just call me? I'll have you know. I'm a Yowie fan girl, and proud. You don't insult me. And by the way, no, no, it's not yay. Do you even know where that word came from? Japan. Gay came from Japan. The proper term for gay is Yowie. And just because I'm I write Yaoi fanfiction. I have many people who like my Yaoi posts on fanfiction.net and DeviantArt. I read Yaoi every single day. Yaoi is my life. I couldn't live without Yaoi. I would die without it. I I'm not stupid! I read my first dojinshi when I was 10. I'm not like other kids, so stop saying that I am! I'm sick of it. I'm so fucking sick of it all. I'll have you know that I knew that first days when I was nine fucking years old. Nine! I was fucking nine! I bet you didn't know what a penis was when you were nine! I might tell you. It's not gay. Do your research! Oh, and by the way, gay porn is disgusting! It's nothing like Yaoi. It's unrealistic and gross. The UKs are usually not even shorter than the Cine. It's disgusting! Fuck all of you! I'm 11 and I'm not stupid. Because I actually know about the origin of Yaoi, and you don't. Fuck you. Fuck off! Today, my friend Mondo tells me, Gabriel, you know what? Felipe is always messing with us. Why don't you mess with him? I go, what should I do? He goes, well, why don't you crank call him? I go, dude, that's a good idea. <laughs> it's like a little kid, right? I picked up the phone. I was like, doo, doo, doo. Hello? Hello, sir. Hi, this is the front desk. Listen, we're having a report of a lot of noise coming from your room. Do you think you could please keep the noise down? Oh, I'm sorry, fool. I didn't know making noise. Thank you, sir. Please keep it down. Okay. Ten minutes later, call them back. <laughs> Hello? Hello, sir! Hi, front desk again. Listen, obviously you did not understand what I said earlier about the noise. You need 
need to keep the noise down. But I'm not making. So listen. <laughs> you either keep down the noise, or we're gonna call the authorities. Okay. I'm sorry. Thank you. And before I hung up the phone, I said this: "Damn Mexicans." <laughs> Swear to God, the Mexican Revolution started all over again. Man. He was mad. He came running over to the room, right? He started pounding on the door, right? <laughs> Open the door. <laughs> oh, we got him! 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 All right, shut up, dude. Shut up. Shut up. Dude. <laughs> shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're not gonna believe it. This hotel is racist. Really? Why do you say that? Fool, I lay at the front desk. She doesn't like Mexicans. Well, what are you gonna do about it? Fool, I'm gonna go shoot her. <laughs> Dude, don't go shooting anybody. Maybe you just need to go talk to her. Talk. Mondo, tell him. Yeah, you should go talk. Fool, that's what I'm gonna do. So he starts walking away. I'm like, Mondo, we gotta see this, right? So we start following him towards the lobby, right? Felipe gets mad halfway and starts running. I'm like, dude, don't run, me and Mondo. Hercules, Hercules. <laughs> Trying to run. Felipe makes it to the lobby like 30 seconds before we do, right? And keep in mind, the girls at the counter, they don't know what's going on. They're doing their job. They're checking people in. They're giving out keys, right? They're like, okay, thank you. Please come again. Okay, here you go. All right, here's your keys. Hi, right, here. Okay. And here comes Felipe, right? <laughs> okay. Which one of your bitches said Mexican? <laughs> and they started freaking out. Oh, my God. There's an angry Latino. Oh my God, look, it's not my fault the Raiders lost, okay? <laughs> Don't take it out on me, please, okay? So he keeps yelling at him, going back and forth, right, this and that. Finally, Mondo and I make it to the lobby, all winded, right? <laughs> Olive, Olive, don't do it, dude, don't do it. Oh, shut up. You don't know what's going on. Felipe can explain everything. Oh, shut the hell up. All of a sudden, a security guard comes in, grabs Felipe, and starts trying to put him down. Right? I'm like, oh, should I let this get out of hand? I'm like, I got to break this up. Felipe, let me explain. Oh, shut the hell up. So I grabbed his ear and I said, sir. <laughs> You're going to need to keep the noise down. Oh, was that you? Yes, sir. You're an asshole, fool. I know, sir. But it was funny, huh? 